So, what's new with you, Kratos? Murdered any good pantheons lately? Devastated any populations with the cataclysmic consequences of your actions? Turned on any once trusted allies? You simply must bring me up to speed on your latest saga of blood-soaked vengeance. I am that no longer. You don't mean to say you've gone soft. Never believe it. Once a Spartan, always a Spartan. No, there's no fooling me, Kratos. You know what they say. You can't hide in the shadows from a sun god. At least, that's what we should say. a little more familiar, isn't it? A mighty chain. Auspicious sign. You've always had such luck with chains. This is all gonna work out just great for you. I can feel it. Now this room must really take you back. Wasn't this the Chamber of Sacrifice? Where you let an Athenian soldier burn to a crisp, just so you could get past the room? Oh, those madcap early days. How you must miss them. Kratos! You mean to sacrifice me? Again? towards my demise. What a special little personal touch. Really lets me know where I stand. Especially after such a long and agonized deliberation over what to do. Oh, how reluctant you'll tell people you were to sacrifice me to the flame. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
idiot. But you do remember I'm a sun god, right? You think I'm afraid of a little fire? Don't threaten me with a good time, Kratos. Maybe I'll be infused with power and achieve my final form. Maybe I'll explode and take you with me. Let's just see what happens. Let's just see. Okay, seriously, Kratos, get me out of this cage. It's not funny anymore. I can't believe you mean to roast me on a whim, on a presumption that it's what Valhalla wants from you. Have you ever considered that maybe your instincts are just random thoughts that pop into your head, no more likely to be true than the next? Hmm? Maybe consider that. Quickly! going to incinerate me and see what happens? I swear, you haven't changed one solitary... Brother? What am I doing in here? Over here. Over here. What's that? No. No! Get me out of here. Brother. What is this? Help me! I'm trying! Do not panic. We will simply return to the gate. I don't think so. I think you've broken how Valhalla works. Oh, I think this is it, brother. Look at you. You shouldn't have done that. Oh, heal, dummy. You and Kratos would not. But you're safe now. Sigrun, I'm sorry. I've been so foolish. I... Later, love. <laughs> I need a moment. I will be forever in yours. <clears throat> My lady! Stop. You've seen me worse. I'm not sure about that, boss. Hush. It's nothing air can't be. <coughs> this could take some time. Go on, Kratos. Get back in there. And do what you need to do.
Well, that was altogether bloody terrifying. One moment I'm in a forest, the next I'm in a cage full of fire. You changed into Helios and back again. It was unpredictable. I'll say. I'm truly not sure if we've gone too far, or if we've come too far to stop. We are not stopping. I must face this. I know, brother. Aha! Another of those spots for bargaining with Valhalla. Memory of Vanaheim now. Brother, I beg you not to remember the exploding plants. What did you say about a forest? You remember being elsewhere where heroes took your place? Aye. Yes, I didn't mention that while we were plummeting, but yes, I was in a forest, much like that of my youth. Back on my own body, too. Uh, of course, brother. Yeah! 
It's worth the price it exacts, brother. edge for this attempt, perhaps. Don't pretend to be interested in my romantic life, brother. I am interested, and you are evading the question. What happened? Well, after you dropped me off at a longhouse the other night, you made a cowberry and hazelnut pudding. Of course, I don't eat anymore, so slightly awkward, but a lovely thought. And? Pretty much it, really. Hmm. There is more to this.
One Valhalla Fox. Right then, time to ascend to the next area, if you're ready. I've been waiting to have a word with you. Uh, we are seeking. She is resting, healing. What she did for you two in there, that should not have happened. It's bad enough you're risking your own lives, but it isn't just you paying the price. This is exactly what I was worried about. Freya, what do you wish? That I quit? Sigrun believed I should see this through. That Valhalla can help. Yes, 
She does. I... I just want you to be careful. I need her. And I need you too. No more bending the rules in there. All right? All right. I can't help reflecting that you only broke Valhalla's rules to save me. I wouldn't have let you. I'd known Sigrun would suffer for it. Sigrun has no such regret. The resilient warrior dances with change, easily adjusting to its rhythm. Valhalla, where legends are made... Better yourself if and when you can, I always say. happened that night between you and Sigrun? Well, we stayed up much too late. I told her stories, she told me secrets. She put spirits to my lips, even though I can't get drunk. Then she invited me to watch her fall asleep. And the next morning? The next morning we took a boat along the Lake of Nine. It was divine, brother. The lake was sun-dappled, and the air was crisp and perfect. You could smell the thaw. When did you speak? Not to interrupt, but... Right side, brother!
Leah, tell me, what happened between you and Sigrun on the lake? Well, she was rowing past where you found her family treasury. Where we learned she cursed her brother over forbidden love. That's right. And as we rowed by, I remember feeling grateful that the place was now deep underwater where she couldn't see it. And at that moment, she turned to me and she said, I think, Mimir, I might be smitten with you. I think maybe I want to kiss you. Mm. Mm. Indeed, brother. I should focus now. Do what you need. <laughs> 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 Sigrun, I am still waiting for the part where you spoke. In my defense, I only told her the truth as it struck me in the moment. I told her my feelings for her were deep as Rand's Hall and had been for as long as I'd known her. But just then a kind of revelation came over me. The sudden cold clarity that it was vanity to imagine that I, as I am, could be enough for her as she is. So I heard myself tell her that I didn't think I could give her what she needed. Now, I have mad at you. Pile on, brother. I deserve it. Right 
One you need it. Ended. I think we're free and fear to take the way up now. <clears throat> Hard not to take Valhalla up on some help, even if it's just for this attempt. Go! 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 Go!
can't bear the thought of Seekrin having damaged herself to save us. Or having damaged her connection to Valhalla, which she'd doubtless say was worse. Will there be consequences beyond her injuries? I don't suppose I can be sure of that either way. But I'm certainly going to begin worrying about it now. Thank you kindly. What a thrill!
killed another of Valhalla's targets. Nifty.
Like your fight's tougher after all. Uh -oh. 